hello guys welcome back to my channel in this video i will show you how we can get the split screen multitasking in any iphone in any model here you guys can check here in my iphone x i'm using multitasking split screen and i can use any application using split screen in multitasking option here you guys can see here how you can get i will show you the full video so just enjoy that how this looks in your device here So firstly guys let's see how this works as you guys can check here this is my iPhone and in my iPhone for example let assume I'm using Instagram application here so this will be the Instagram so right now I would like to open YouTube app how I can open in multitasking screen I just need to simply swipe up and you will see that a uh, dock will available here now I just need to hold and drag YouTube application here the side of the screen and you will get the youtube app in the multitasking screen here you guys can check here i can use youtube and i can also use instagram app and the bigger iphone screen will help us it will it will look more impressive in the bigger iphones for example max iphones or plus iphones so now i can increase the size of instagram i can upload videos photos or any post i want to upload and in youtube i can just use to try the youtube videos so after playing a video i I can just minimize this YouTube app something like this one and try to use any other app for example I would like to open any other app I will open Safari browser so I just need to simply op drag and hold the Safari browser and I, I want to add instead of YouTube I want to add Instagram so I just need to hold and drag and set this app on that application so basically this is the simple concept and for example if you want to add more applications in your doc like music app share it app you can drag and hold that app in the dock and you will get most of the apps in your this dock so this will be the simple fix so so now guys let's see that how we can get these features in our iphone so firstly in this method to use this method your iphone should be jailbreak which means that Syria should be installed. I have jailbreak my iPhone using Jcrane. If you want to jailbreak your iPhone, there are two methods. The first one is without computer method and the second one is using computer. All the methods links will be available in description. You can go and check out that videos that how we can jailbreak our iPhone. That is the another method or process. So after jailbreaking, Syria application will be installed in your iPhone. So you guys can see here, this is how the Syria looks like. You just need to go to this search bar here and in this search bar just search for a tweak name which is known as floating dock as you guys can see here floating just type here floating and you will find here floating dock plus 13 slash 14 basically this is the tweak but this tweak is paid as you guys can see here $1.99 USD so we are going to use free tweak here this tweak is from hack your iphone repo and this is totally free as you guys can check here so if this tweak is not available in your search results what you need to do just go back to the safari browser in the safari browser you just need to just search for a tweak just search for a website name hack your iphone you guys can see here i have just go to the hack your iphone.org and you will see this website here you just need to simply click on add to Cydia. just click on open Cydia, and now this source will be open in Cydia. you will install this source and after installing you will available you will be able to see this tweak in your search results now install this tweak and after installing after respring your iphone after respringing you just need to alter a setting go to the settings here now scroll up and you will find here floating dock plus 13 to 14 this option will be turned off in your case you need to turn this option on and after turning on click on respring option and after respringing you will be able to use all these features in the multitasking screen now you can add any of the application in this dock you can also remove any of the app you want to remove the app from the dock and you want to add any other app you can just simply turn that option you can just simply drag and hold this app in and move to the dock so this is the simple fix i hope you find this method helpful please guys share this video with your friends thanks for watching stay tuned thank you so much